Hi hey everybody, Rob here. Just giving you an update on the 4.5 gallon Sportster gas tank. It's Saturday. Beautiful day to be out for a ride. But instead, I'm out here on the back patio using the jacuzzi for a workbench sanding the tank down. Okay, this was the first skim coat of the Bondo. As you can see, I have discovered I have high spots in it and I have low spots in it. On both sides of the tank, there's kind of like a dimple, okay? And then, of course, there's where the dent was out there. Got to put another coat over it. And on both sides, it was dished in just a little bit here. So, I'm going to smooth that out. It's dished in a little bit on the top here. Got to put another little layer right in there. And like I said, you can see where there's high spots in it. This is kind of high here. There's like a peak right there. And that's all in the manufacturing process. There's another peak right there. There's like a low spot here. So, my wife wanted to know why do you have to bond to a brand new tank? That's why. Because in the manufacturing process, you're going to get high spots like here and here and here. And you're going to get low spots like in here, here here and right there so instead of out riding on such a nice beautiful day in central california i'm here working on the tank but i'm gonna slap on another coat of bondo and uh, i think i'm gonna head for a ride so see y'all later bye bye